After an uncomplicated pregnancy and a very normal delivery, a beautiful baby girl was put in my arms about five years ago. But I immediately thought there must be something wrong. I kept asking over and over, is she okay? Is she okay? It turns out that she actually wasn't okay. My mother's instinct uh, was something I could rely on that day. Over the next six days, she deteriorated quite rapidly. And then we took her into Children's Hospital. But as it turned out, she needed immediate open heart surgery to save her life. The doctors told us there were two holes in her heart and that that would be the easy part. I remember studying the surgeon's hands. I looked at them closely when he walked into the room and wondered, is, are those the hands that can save her life? Is, is he the one? Does, does he have it in him to do this job? And when I asked him, his simple and confident answer was what I really needed to hear. He said, yes, I can do this. They told me she may struggle to walk, to talk, and may never actually eat on her own. I remember Emily opening her mouth to cry after the surgery, and no sound would come out. I wondered if we'd ever hear her voice. Our time in the cardiology department would be just the beginning of our journey with BC Children's Hospital. She's been to immunology, respirology, hematology, neurology, audiology, the ear, nose and throat specialist, plastic surgery, and the sleep clinic, child life services. And throughout her journey, Emily has had two open heart surgeries and several heart procedures in between. As she grows, she'll require three more heart surgeries before she's 20 years old. During the countless hours we've spent at BC Children's Hospital, one thing has stayed with me. The incredible caring nature of the staff. I really feel that they love Emma Lee. They care for her and they want the best for her. I couldn't have asked for more. Today, Emma Lee is five years old. And although frequent visits to BC Children's Hospital will always be a part of Emma Lee's childhood and our family's life, she's not letting that keep her from anything. You know, I, I, well, there was a point when I would have thought it would have been great to say that Amelie is a, a typical little girl. But I can say now she's not. She is absolutely unstoppable. She is never to be outdone by her brothers and gets so much joy out of life, everyday moments. And we get joy out of all of her moments because we never ever could take them for granted. We never knew if she would be alive or well enough to enjoy simple childhood moments like splashing in a puddle or jumping through a hula hoop. Every moment is a joyous celebration of life. We call Amélie our little miracle. But we know that she's just one of many, many miracles you've helped make possible thanks to your support of BC Children's Hospital. I just want to take this opportunity to say thank you for giving my daughter a chance at a healthy future. BC Children's Hospital saved Amelie's life. I can't even begin to put into words how grateful I am for this. But the fact is, every day children like Amelie are born in need of serious, specialized medical care. These children spend their first moments on earth struggling for life. They depend completely on us for answers, to deliver the treatments, and to do everything we can to keep their tiny hearts beating. These innocent children count on one incredible, life-saving place, and that's BC. Children's Hospital. Will you help the next child who's born like Emma Lee and every other child after them by making a gift today? Your generosity is the only hope children like Emma Lee have of receiving the most advanced state-of-the-art care. Thanks to you, Emma Lee's future looks so bright. In fact, she's just started kindergarten and may have a promising future in gymnastics. It's hard to believe that the little baby who was born with a broken heart and the child who struggled with a failing body so hard all her life is now active and vibrant. She's overcome every imaginable obstacle and is now beating the odds every day. My wish is that her story touches your heart and encourages you to help countless other children beat the odds by giving generously as you can today. It's truly worth every penny. From the bottom of our hearts, thank you. Thank you.